wicked crowd of Larnia. Darkness falls as the humans beg their king to save them. A noble king known only as the Grand Wizard. For a thousand years, the battle has been waged, with only the bravery of the Grand Wizard to protect his human followers. But even though the Wizard King is so undeniably true, the Drow Elf armies continue their attacks. They seek the human's most treasured relic, the Stick of Truth. But the tides of war are soon to change, as news of a new king spreads throughout the land. In order to save the humans, the Grand Wizard must get to the new king, before the Drow Elf can manipulate his hand and use him to take the sacred relic from human hands. For whomever controls the stick controls the universe. That's everything. We did it, hun. We are really moved in. It's a new beginning for us. Things are finally going to be good. Do you really think it will be better for him? They won't look for him here. We just need to make sure he doesn't attract any attention. Come on, let's see how he's doing. Sweetie, hun, you all dressed? Hey, champ. How do you like your new room? I know it's a big change for all of us, but... Son, do you... remember why we moved to this quiet little mountain town? He doesn't remember. He doesn't remember at all. That's good, that's good he doesn't remember. Uh, sweetie? We want you to have lots of fun here. Why don't you go out and make some friends? Right, get outside and play, son. Like... like normal kids. We've got some money for you on the kitchen counter, sweetie. Just be back before it gets dark. Yeah, we love you too.
Come on, son. Get out there. Make friends. Hey, no fair. That's cheating. I'm gonna tell my mom. Thanks, kid. I didn't realize he had a health potion. <laughs> my name is Butters the Merciful. I'm a paladin. I live right next door to you. We should be friends. You should speak with the Wizard King. He's been talking about your arrival. The wizard lives this way, in the greenhouse, over there. Hey, where are you from? Where'd you live before moving here? You that Colorado? So, you are the new kid. You're coming was foretold by Coldwell Banker. I am the Wizard King, but the time for talk is not nigh. Let me show you my kingdom. Oh, who's your new friend, Eric? Don't talk. Shut up, Mom. Not now. Welcome to the kingdom of Koopa Keep. Our weapon shop here is tended by Clyde, a level 14 warrior. Here you can see our massive stables, overseen by the level 9 ranger, Scott Malkinson, who has the power of diabetes. And here, of course, is the breathtaking and lovely Princess Kinney, the fairest maiden in all the kingdom. Don't ask why Kinney wanted to be a chick, it's just how he seems to be rolling right now. You may have heard of my deeds at the Battle of Stark's Pod. My loyalty is as incurable as my diabetes. Be careful. The Rock of Insanity holds mysterious powers. Okay, you're insane now. If you want to be healed, you must gaze at the rock again. Okay, you're healed. Okay, you're insane now. 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 Okay, you're insane now. Okay, you're insane now. Okay, you're healed. Okay, you're insane now. 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 Hey, where the hell are you going? You have been sought out, new kid, because humans everywhere are in great danger. I need something from you, and in return, I am prepared to allow you into my kingdom. I know you are very excited. It's time for your first quest, but first, please tell us thy name. You entered Douchebag, is that correct? Are you sure you want to keep the name Douchebag? Very well, Douchebag. You will now choose a class. Fighter, Mage, Thief, or Jew. A mage is like a wizard, only not as cool. A fighter has courage, honor, and the ability to kick fucking ass. A mage is like a wizard, only not as cool. You look sneaky enough to be a thief. 
Jew, huh? So I guess we'll never really be friends. You look sneaky enough to be a- A mage is like a fighter has courage, honor, and the ability to kick fucking ass. A mage is like a- You look sneaky enough to be a thief. We welcome to our kingdom, Douchebag the Thief. Hooray! Now please, go and visit the weapon shop. Procure yourself a weapon and we shall teach you to fight. The power of diabetes is both a gift and a curse, but mostly a curse. Would you like to see my wares, weary traveler? Perhaps you would like to hear tips and rumors for two dollars? Don't waste your money on tips and rumors. Ah, a lovely purchase. But don't let it bother you that there's a game to be played. Good, now how about you equip your weapon instead? <laughs> ah, you have procured a weapon. Nice. It's now time to teach you how to fight. I want you to take your new weapon and, with the bravery of a noble knight, beat up Clyde. What? Kick Clyde's ass, new kid. What I do? I'm the king, Clyde, and the king wishes to be amused. Go on, new kid, kick his ass. I'm gonna kick your ass. Clyde, you have to wait your turn. That's lame. No, Clyde, it's like olden times. You have to wait your turn. Like in the Middle Ages, Clyde. I know it's lame, Clyde, but that's how we're fucking doing it. All right, douchebag, bash Clyde's face in. Don't be shy. Oh! Ah! Oh, hell yeah, Clyde's your bitch. All right, Clyde's wearing armor. In order to hurt him, I want you to hit Clyde as hard as you can. Fucking nice, bro. It's exactly what you do to guys with armor like that. Okay, listen up. The key to surviving in battle is not to get hit in the bows. Clyde, it's your turn to attack. Douchebag, protect your bows. Prepare yourself. Die. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Dude, you're already way better than Clyde. All right, it's time to use your heroic powers. Using your ability takes power points, or PP for short. <laughs> PP. <laughs> If you have a fucking better name for them, then fucking say it, Clyde! Fucking asshole! I'm the king, and I say it's PP! Douchebag, use your thief ability to make Clyde pay for insulting the king. Didn't count! Way to wipe that smile off his stupid face, douchebag! Now do it one more time. Finish him! What? I was going easy. Take this! This is unblockable. <laughs> Dude, that was awesome! You were all like, beam, and Clyde was all like, nah, nah. <laughs> okay, okay, you prove yourself worthy, douchebag. Now come inside the war tent, and I shall let you see the relic. Well, here it is. The reason why humans and elves are locked in a never-ending war. The relic for which human and elf are willing to die. The Stick of Truth. Just two days ago, we took the stick back from the elves. Our kingdom was dying, but now it thrives. For whoever controls the stick, controls the universe. Don't gaze at it too long, for its power is too much for mere mortals to look at. Now that you have seen the Stick of Truth, let's discuss your dues. Being a member of my kingdom costs $9.95 for the first week. Four dollars of which is tax deductible. Alarm! 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 Someone has sounded the alarm! 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 What is it? The elves are attacking! Oh my god! Defensive position! Douchebag, come help us! Man the gate! Don't let them through! Give us the stick, human! Fuck you, Drow Elf! Come and get it! Clyde, guard the stick of truth while we defend the fortress! Aye, aye! Aye, aye! We're not playing pirates, Clyde! Douchebag, this is your chance to prove yourself. Hold off the asshole elves at all costs! Uh. Fuck you, asshole! Ugh. Help! Help! Do it, 
douchebag kicked these out asses. You want some of this? You're wounded, douchebag. Potions will heal you. Here. The rules say you can have one potion every turn. I asked for five, but this is coming. This guy's fast, douchebag. Try to block all these attacks. Die, asshole! <laughs> Okay, if you block all the attacks, you get a counterattack. Look at your enemy on the ground. Weak and helpless. Kick the shit out of him. Awesome, you kicked his helpless ass. Now finish off these elves in the name of the Wizard King. waiting for you, dude. You can't just hit him like that. You need to try a different tactic to damage him. Look at that archer hiding behind his friend like a wood. Switch to your arrow, douchebag. Snipe that little bitch. Sweet, now you can hit the guy in the back. Go for the pink mint. Oh, yeah. yeah, bitch, that's what you get for fucking with the wizard king. Careful, douchebag. That guy's ready for your arrows now. You gotta try something else. Do this, douchebag. Okay, that guy has a shield. Shields are super weak. Just hit them with your simplest hit over and over to wear them down quickly. Uh, hell yeah, that's how you do it. The other elf let his guard down. Now's your chance. Power attack his armor. as hard as you can, her armor's gonna soak up all the damage. You'll pay for that. That's it, now finish him! Now! Ah. Sweet, now you can hit the guy in the back. Go for the pink thing! Ah. Now! <laughs> God. What? The stick of truth. The elves got it. That was your one goddamn job, Clyde! To guard the stick of fucking truth! Clyde, you are hereby banished from space and time! What? No! 
You can't do that. Yeah, I can. You're banished and lost in time and space. Yeah. Go home, Clyde. You fought bravely on the battlefield, douchebag. <laughs> if you can make me a douchebag, like you sure can fight. Shut up, Scott. Nobody cares what you think. Anyways, we have a bigger problem now. The stick of truth has been stolen, and we must assemble our entire army in order to get it back. But our three best warriors still haven't reported for duty, my king. Our newest member can take care of that. Douchebag, I want you to go out into the neighborhood and find my greatest warriors, Token, Tweak, and Craig. I'm texting their pictures to your personal inventory device now. But beware. The lands outside are full of marauding drow elves, monsters, and sixth graders. Be sure you're well equipped. Now go! And send my warriors here! Fighters, go with him! We aren't allowed to go into the street. When it's such an open world, our parents don't want us getting hurt. Behold! The residence of Butters the Merciful. Ah, this must be the new kid. We're playing, Dad. Good for you. You Facebook me right away if Butters does something he should be grounded for. Butters really is a very sweet boy. I hope you'll treat him as you would a normal child. Welcome to my room. My minions. They help me punish society. Ah! The Wizard King says I'm too ginger to be one of the humans, but Paladin Butters lets me be his squire on the sly. Paladins seek justice for all races. Hold many dangers, new kid. Yeah, you moved to the wrong realm. Nice hair, douchebag. Take that! Die, asshole! I do any more healing. Wait, you guys. I have your sneeze. No, false alarm. By the hammer of butters. Ah. I just we'll see if it works. Mad 
magic cure potion. Make sure you always carry a few potions. Just don't get grounded for raiding the apothecary's pantry like I do. I hope he didn't hurt you too bad. Well, hey, Officer Butt Dady. That's Butt Brady. Wait. Rumor the girls have a secret this base, but I've never seen it. This is where heroes. Give it back! Give it back! Why don't you make us? That's my Justin Bieber toy. Not anymore, it's not. Aw, did baby lose her toy? Come on, you guys. You gonna cry? It isn't yours. What are you gonna do about it? She's got nothing. Maybe. Oh, what sad times these are when the nation's youth run around in dungeon clothes playing the games of Satan. Young man, if you really want power, there's only one thing you must do. Find Jesus. Find him, and when you do, return to me. Wow, you look pretty desperate. You know you can die from a titty twister? This is where Jimmy gave me that noogie Where's one time. Where's your leash, human dog? Fuck you, asshole! Stop it! Yeah. Uh. Yo, dog. Uh, can't I just go right back home after the flight so I don't get grounded?
Can you keep a secret? Neither can I. <laughs> you found me. Tee hee hee. Next time finding me won't be so easy. Oh, it's on. Quit it. We've been getting reports of a bunny rabbit running... Do not despair, for many find Jesus only to lose him later, but the soul that does not abandon its search will surely be rewarded with his company. Remember that.
<laughs> we must get back to the question. Uh, well done, my son. I hope you didn't peek. Remember, I will always be at the side of those who have found me. You can call me once per day with this, but I can't help against bosses. They're scary. Come find me again for another. Oh, you want some of this? Stan one time gave me the grossest wet willy right here. If you ever want some work done on your nose, see Dr. Tom. Goddamn, I'm going. Hey, no fighting in here. Hey, no fighting in here. <coughs> hey, no fighting in here. All right, welcome to Shitty Walk. Take all the praise. Only thing we're serving today is Mongolian beef. Mongolian beef, so good. Oh, I just love it. Oh, hello, Mongolian. Shh, Mongolians are watching. They conquered me last week at Natural. Oh, yeah, Mongolian beef. Mmm, so tasty, right? Wow. It's not tasty at all. It's gross. Don't eat it. You eat a Mongolian beef, you shit your pants for five days. All right, Mongolian. Please, you gotta help me out. The Mongolians all live like rats in the Tower of a Peace next door. I'll keep the adults occupied here. You go top a tower and beat up all their kids. Beat up all the Mongolian kids. Then Mongolian think this neighborhood not a safe place. They move away. Go, go. Beat up the little Mongolian kids. Oh, all right, Mongolian. Mongolian beef smell like a Rhino Richie's asshole. Hamburgers. Some of Chinik San Butler said Lada. I ingrid Shangra Hood. Breaks in that. We're gonna send you straight to heck! I'm tired of 
being picked on. Machen geht schon rauf. By the hammer of butters. That was the most perfect throw I've ever seen. Şeyine mag orlu yüz ben su. Çatırım için yer tut lino. Mark Nixon, but most of the Yahoo, and more by the banner. Rigsenda. My Ingrid Shangrahurt. She is the Troton Moelma. Başlamak. 